Hi, this is a quick video showing our Fox PC distribution running a Linux KDE desktop. I'm doing this on a Motorola G7 phone. I'm using the screen recorder function here. It's just very easy to capture videos with that. So this is Moto G7 running Android 11. So let me start up the Fox PC desktop. The Fox PC desktop is based on Debian Bullseye XFCE. It runs as an application on top of Android. We don't make any changes to Android. We just need root access. So this is Debian XFCE 4.16. This is 64-bit distribution. I'm going to start the KDE desktop. This is going to boot up soon. So this is a nested desktop. That means this KDE desktop runs on top of an XFCE desktop, which is actually running on top of Android. In fact, I can swipe it, go back to Android, this is Android, and then I can come back to the Linux desktop. Uh, this is running as a default user, which is desktop, and audio is also supported within this desktop. In fact, I can play video file. We have main engine start. Four, three, two, one. Increase the volume a little bit. So this desktop is running the original X11 server. XTPY info will give me more information about the X server. This is the original XOG X11 server. Our Fox PC desktop uses our own graphics stack. Well, it is fast and runs most of the application it is not 100% compatible. In fact, it is almost impossible to make it 100% compatible to XOG X11, which has been around for a long time. So that's the reason we provide this compatibility environment. Uh, what we provide on as default is a basic black box window manager that you can launch within the nested desktop, and then you can launch your X11 applications that don't run on the Fox PC desktop. But of course, we have modified it to run the whole KDE desktop. And if you prefer, you can also run any desktop as a nested version. You can also exit from this desktop. So, so basically we can provide 100% compatibility to it. And you can run any Linux desktop application that runs on X11. We can run it on Fox PC desktop. And of course we are running this on Android. So any, any of the Android applications are also available. That's what I wanted to show you. That's all for now. Thank you folks for listening to this video. I'm going to stop the recording.